Hey there, Bourbon Street Joe here, back again for another Two for Tuesday. Um, this time we'll be doing a direct comparison. <laughs> he says, hopefully. Um, a direct comparison between uh, two identical, identical rations. Um, so we will go to CT's favorite country that starts with L. Um, I think I teased it in my Latvian video, um, where I said, not that L, the other L. But I know CT's favorites are Lithuanian rations. So here is our two for Tuesday. So this is a uh, Lithuanian uh, eight-hour ration. This is menu number four. This is pork with groats. So I think it's buckwheat uh, with sauce. Now this is the older version that everybody has seen, knows, loves, etc. Six sixty-eight or one pound, seven and a half ounces. Boop. Now this, apparently, maybe, might be, the new version of this. Now, these are on eBay currently. Um, they're being marketed as Lithuanian rations, same as same as these. Now, you can see Maisto. Having this, you can, maybe you can read that. It might be easier that way. And this one is Maisto Davinaya, or however I mispronounce that. So I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Um, the menus seem to be the same. So I like the packaging. I. Again, I, I, I haven't seen the inside. I don't know what it looks like, but it, it, it just, that doesn't, I don't, why? That, that seems to be a step back, not a step ahead. I mean, I know it's gusseted, and, but that, you know what I mean? It's not like the Latvian ones that I've done where it's like kind of wimpy terry bag to new gusseted foily. Anyway. Before the scale shuts down, I'll shut up. 425 grams or 15 ounces. So just shy of a pound. So that's 200 grams difference. Two hundred and forty grams difference. Now, is that going to be in packaging or is that going to be? So, let's look at this, shall we? Go to the old one, tear notch right in the middle. That seems kind of weak to me because if you tear that and it does like any bag of chips ever does to any of us, it just goes, which means you, you're not going to be holding refuse or you know whatever if you have to carry something anyway we'll go in through there hopefully we can get a little directionality going here yeah okay fair enough i've never opened one before um just so we get the particulars on that one 2020 10th month 30th day Do 
2024, 2026, 2024, 23, 23. They're fresh, but like I said, I, I can't... Never been inside one before personally, so I can't vouch for the authenticity of that. But I mean, the packaging looks just a little less durable, so maybe a little dubious. But that wouldn't be the first time the army went in a really stupid direction with stuff. That's what's in there. Smell like nothing, which is handy. We have hazelnuts. 2021. Oh, sorry. Bouncy, bouncy. I'm sure there's a weight on there somewhere. I'm just not seeing. okay with those. I've got those in the Polish fashion. So obviously we have wet wipe. One, two, three, four fuel tabs. A spoon and some oh and the tiniest zip tie in the world. Actually, blue tip. All right. We have our main. We have our moldable, bendable, foldable food here. Sorry, puppy. Knocked the world away from me again. Okay. Obviously, our main. I won't open that just yet. Accessory, honey, chocolate. Oh, there's your list of contents. So we have chocolate, sugar, black tea, Going to be a sit vitamin. Okay, so it's a oh right there, lemon flavored instant drink with vitamin C. And again, your list of contents. So that's the older style. Now we'll see if this is indeed a newer style of the same thing or whether it's just marketed as a newer style. Of the, okay, so it's got a plastic liner, not a foil liner like the old Canadian. And he's had a zip on it. Stewed, stewed pork and groats, or with groats in sauce, pardon me. Recyclable, 240 grams. Nut weight, meal weight, 100 grams. You have some. Maybe dry roasted peanuts. Looks like there might be some sugary, salty coating of some sort in there with them. Little wooden spoon. Guessing this is an energy bar, seeing as how it seems to be coffee flavored, enriched with coffee. So I don't think, well, that could be chocolate. Jam, I'll have to translate that.
biscuits and a wet wipe. Oh, okay. All right, well, uh, sure. So we'll get these rearranged, um, laid out as similar as we can get them, and uh, yeah, we'll look about how to, uh, trying them both having that meal. Be right back. Okay, we're back. We have this laid out. Um, so let's attack this um, as we can. We have a tiny little wooden spoon for the newer one, and this is stewed pork with groats and sauce. Um, net weight 240, um, meal weight 100. I, I honestly don't know what that means. Um, I mean, it's a package of something. Right. Tear notch here. So I have some water boiling in the background here. I will get that into there. So at least we can heat it up and see. <clears throat> and we have a large plastic spoon on this side, the original side, I guess. Um, stewed pork with groats in sauce. 240 gram, 100 gram. That is identical to what I just put in there. So uh, I don't... I eh, Same manufacturer, I think. Um, not an easily distinguishable tear notch on this one. I think there's one there. But um, let's get that um, in there with the other one. And then we'll go back to what we have. So spoon, spoon. Um, so we have the biscuits, crackers, what have you. Um, there's your... Expiry, I'm assuming, 10, 1, 20, 26. And you have two, obviously, and here you have four. Uh, 16, 06, 20, 21. So, okay, so we got that. Um, this translated as strawberry jam, so we have that for that. This uh, metis is obviously honey hard as a rock so that's crystallized we have 20 2023 so that are uh, we hope that's our dry roasted peanuts maybe could be salty could be sweet not sure we have hazelnuts on this side um, again I couldn't find a weight on this like um, there's a 2021 expo. Oh, 56 grams. Sorry, it's in there. Um, on that net. Refreshing towelette. Refreshing towel. Like same packaging, yet slightly different. This has a T. Black tea. Um, this has no beverages whatsoever. Um, this also has a, uh, a sports drink or, or lemon flavor instant drink with vitamin C. Um, we have our fuel tabs, um, three, not four, as I counted earlier, miscounted, obviously. Our blue tip matches. We also have sugar, um, our tiny little zap strap, um, and Ruta chocolates. There's our expiration on that, and 36 grams. Don't believe. As a cocoa solid percentage, it might, I'm not sure. And we have our pupa, enhanced with coffee, whatever this is, 
over here. So, um, I do have the foldy bendy bendy foldy stove done over there. Um, I'm not sure. I don't think I'll bother to use these to try to heat some water to see how efficient that is. Um, it, it honestly doesn't seem worth it. Um, but again, comparing the two, I mean, sorry, um, these seem very similar. The mains seem, the labels are almost identical. Um, the, the Panzer Waffles. So maybe that's where the 200 gram saving is. Half this, no drink powder, no tea, no sugar. I mean, this you're gonna rely on water, I guess. Um, again, honey, jam. We'll see, I guess. Um, let's start dishing stuff out and uh, comparing what we can. So, I don't know, let's wash our hands, as it were. Lemon refreshing towel. Um, also, we have, um, in this one, not this one, we have an FRH, as well as a stove. So, that's kind of odd, but, um, okay. But, uh, this one is, obviously, lemon-scented. Kind of smells like... Toilet bowl cleaner or like a hand sanitizer wipe, like Vim or Clorox or something very wet. Dries quickly, but leaves a scent behind. And this one is. The exact same thing, despite the vague difference in the characters and lettering on the outside or words. Not easy to pry apart though. But it's a paper, not a cloth. Yeah, same smell. Very industrial kind of disinfectant smell. Um, let's try our newer nuts. Slightly salty. You know, like a standard dry roasted peanut planters, that kind of thing. Um, hazelnuts. <clears throat> Didn't take far enough, of course. Those are a little rancid. Ugh. Those are going out. Oh, they're going out to feed the squirrels tomorrow. Oh yeah, those are. Those are not good. Black tea.
one of two beverages we have on this side, which we don't have on that side. Um, Spillage. Get that in there. Of course, the other one is our lemon flavor instant drink with vitamin C. Thirty grams, and that takes. I honestly can't tell. It says 600 milliliters of water, but that seems... Caked up, stuck in the package, and I uh, got most of it, I think. There she looks. It smells lemon, so that's something at least. I shut the mains off there. Fill this up as far as I can because it might take 600, but wow. <clears throat> For yellow, as you can see. into the tea, which I won't use. Matches I can put aside. Let's maybe take a look at our chocolate, which has bloomed. It has obviously the company embossed on it. Two pieces. Nice break on that. Mm. Very tasty chocolate. Mm. And I think this is a coffee infused energy bar. Possibly. Very sweet. I'm not sure if that's it's almost like a a boxed chocolate filling or you know it's not like a Milky Way bar, like it's it's different. It's not chewy. It's fairly tasty. Let's try our 
standard Panzer waffles. <clears throat> Don't smell stale. Have our caraway seeds in there. very um, powdery when you chew it. Not bad. Again, I, I, I do like the flavor of those, um, which is weird, I guess. Try the newer ones. Break about the same. Tastes the same. Try it with some strawberry jam, which is quite mm, not liquid. It's fine. Let's try that mouthful. Jam's very sweet. Just look at the caraway. Mm, not a lot of strawberry flavor. This is really not mixing up and probably a bad mistake. Considering what's not dissolved in there, that's not a bad flavor, actually. <clears throat> I'm not sure if it actually needs 600 mils of water or... It's not like an overpowering lemon. Not a real tea flavor. Um... That out of there. It's a nice black tea. You could honestly scoop out what's left in that, put it in that, be fine. Honey, I'm not going to bother with because it's crystallized and. Same as the last one. Let's go with the larger one. So the way Lithuanian rations I've seen work is at one end you will have the carbohydrate component, the other end is the meat component. So this is best before 2021, so this is the older one. Uh, where's the tear on this? Make roll. Let's get it going. 
down there. That's what that looks like, and it should pour out as pork on one end and I think it was buckwheat on the other, was it not? Anyway. pull out the other one which is best before 2024 which does have a handy dandy tear notch you know what maybe let's go with a small one so that's the older Okay, perfect. And I will be right back. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Mrs. Joe and Coffee are out for a walk, so up to me to check on the wood stove. Um, so, yeah, that's our new and that's our old. Same weight, so apparently same manufacturer, so I guess we'll... That should be the meat. That should be the carb. We'll, we'll try on of each. So same taste, both sides. Obviously, the meat side, very different feel than the carb side. Um, this one, very different, like, hmm. So that tastes the same. Like, despite the difference in how it looks, that is the same meal. So, I, hmm. Yeah, eh, I, I don't know. Um, could be the same thing. Like, honestly, that could be an updated version of this. The hood, the uh, 200 gram difference, like the stove, the matches, the FRH, the sugar, the drink powder. Yeah, yeah there's your 200 grams. Um, so I, I don't know if anybody with more an official like reach that I have somebody on Emory info like maybe K Man or I, I don't know knows more about that can can actually get in touch with somebody from Lithuania to see if that's the new thing but it seems they have the same components taste the same all in all uh, really happy with both I mean I take either, no problem. So, um, yeah, um, I will separate the stuff, weigh it, and uh, bring another two for Tuesday uh, to a close. Be right back.
Okay, so everything is dealt with, cleaned up. So for the older style ration, we are looking at 86. Sorry. Almost forgot the spoon. 90 grams. Or 3.1 ounces. And the newer style we are looking at. Thirty-four or one point two ounces, so a lot less in that one. Of course, there was less to start with, so yeah, I don't know. Um, I have a few more coming, so we'll see how they compare with the old ones. Um, I probably won't do any more twofers, but um, I will review the newer ones as they come in, and um, yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed the uh, Two for Tuesday. Bourbon Street Joe. I'm out. Bye.